What are some games with some of your favorite world designs? Ooh. Mm. Cross had a really good world design, but I think I think the Trail series has one of the most interesting worlds in in JRPG history. All of those games, Trails in the Sky, Trails from Zero, Trails of Cold Steel, you know, they all take place in the same world, and I think that's a really interesting world. I think it's the best, you know, if we're gonna choose what is the best for me personally, the best world building, or the, or the best uh, world design in JRPGs, it will probably be the Trails games. Because they make it through dialogue and through conversations and characters, and by mixing these characters from this and this, from, from this uh, country to this one other, and by slowly building up the tension between regions and nations and countries, you know, little by little, you know, and this arc takes place in this uh, part of the world, and this second arc takes place in this other part of the world, and then then this one brings them all together. And then it's it's just very interesting, you know, very interesting. When I first played Trails in the Sky, I thought it wasn't that interesting, you know. I thought it got he had like a decent lore, you know, a decent lore, decent world, and that's it. But as I started playing the the other ones, you know, in in the they're all connected, they're beautifully connected. I mean, how many other JRPG series are like that? That they all take place in the same world. I mean, there's a few of them, like Suikoden, for example. We'll get into Suikoden in a bit, but um, Trails is probably my favorite. There aren't many JRPG series out there that, that have like 10, 12, 15 games all in the same universe. Sure, there's the Wild Arms series. They all take place in Field Gaia, but it's a different Field Gaia every time. So yeah, Trails. Suikoden will probably be up there. It could be my my favorite world design, but um, ah, should the Trails make it look more interesting? But yeah, Suikoden could easily be my favorite as well, the, the best world design in JRPGs. Because all Suikoden games, the main ones, the first five games and, and tactics, because the one on the Nintendo DS, Suikoden Tear Christ, that's its own game, doesn't take place in the same universe. Uh, the one on the PSP, recently fan translated, um, its own game, its own universe, nothing to do, those are spin offs. But the five main games and Suikoden tactics, which is also a spin-off on the PS2, all those six games take place in the same universe. And there's also Suiko Gaiden 1 and 2, visual novels released only in Japan, but they're fan-translated, and they're pretty short. They're, they're not exactly visual novels, they're more like adventure, text adventure games. You just read a lot and make decisions every now and then that affect the ending and the outcome. They're pretty cool, cool games, Suiko Gaiden on the PS1, 1 and 2. Um, that's a hell of a world, man. They're all connected and... The same as with Trails, you know, the first game takes place in this part, and then the second one takes place in this other part, and they're connected, you know, this one, the second one drags some issues on, on the world, on the first world's politics and shit, you know, and then the third one comes out, and it's, it, it pretty much brings them all together, and then we got the prequels, which are Suicune than 4 and Suicune than 5, Suicune than 5 takes place, like, I think it's 11 years or something, 8 years or so before the first Suikoden. So if you play all those Suikoden games in a row, I mean, it just gets very interesting all how everything is connected, you know. You start noticing things that you didn't notice before when you first played Suikoden 2 or Suikoden 5, you know. But when you play those, those games in a row or when you play them in order, in chronological order, you know, it, it just gets very interesting how all... Oh, this place, this place was also in the in this game, you know. All they mentioned this issue or this part of the lore in this game. So Suikoden, man, I'm such a Suikoden fanboy. It's my favorite video game series of all time. So you know what? Forget about Trails. I think Suikoden, Suikoden has the absolute best JRPG world design in history for me. And then Trails will be a pretty damn close second. <laughs> Those are the best in my opinion.